good morning students how are you all i hope all of you are fine so student this is class 1 our subject is english and date is 23rd march 2020 and day is tuesday so open your books on page number 39 today we are going to do our comprehension work that we have done our chapter a boy who cried wolf we are just going to do some questions from our chapter and we are also going to do words meaning of that one chapter okay so first of all we are going to read about a difficult words that are taken from our chapter a boy who cried wolf our words meanings so the meaning of bored is not feeling good sometime you are saying that i am too bored at home right so not feeling good joke something funny joke means mazak karna danger something that may cause injury khatarnak understand so you are going to write this words meaning in your copies Okay, then I'm going to check it, and you are going to give the topic also a boy who cried wolf. Now, reading comprehension. Our first one question is choose the correct word for each sentences. These are sentences, and here are some words that you are going to choose the word from this sentence correctly word. Okay, and it is all about from the chapter. So I hope all of you know it very well. So number first is number A is the boy was looking after the dish. What was the boy looking after the sheep, geese, goat? So the boy was looking after the sheep. Number B he was on a where was he farm, hill, lorry. He was on a hill. Number C. The boy was dash happy, sad, bored. So bored. The boy was bored. The boy cried dash. She wolf danger. The boy cried she. The people did not eat, go, drink. The people did not go. the wolf killed the boy she people so she the wolf killed the she now turn your pages and today the next next topic is verb so student do you know verb verb is a word which shows action verb is a word which shows action now you are listening to my work and you are sitting so that sitting is called verb so i am going to do my first number question underline the verbs in the following sentences number a my aunt likes or number first is my aunt likes oranges so i am going to underline the verb in this sentence so likes is an action so likes i am going to underline it number b she eats banana eats is action because when you are eating so that eating is action number c she will go to the market go go is the verb d arshina plays with her younger brother so which one will become arshina plays wo khel rahi hai na number e my mother puts the money in her purse so puts is here verb number f the potatoes fell out on the road fell out is the verb this is our verb and you are going to write it in your neat copy and also this is verb definition understand now question number 2 is jumbled jumbled up sentences 
the arrange the sentences jumbled words into meaningful sentences so i am going to do number first one these are jumbled sentences and i am going to write this re jumbled okay rearrange this is not in arrange form so i am going to write it in arrange form okay likes ali dogs and likes sara kids so i am going to write here ali likes dogs and sara likes cats okay now number b elephant the sleeping is the elephant is is sleeping okay playing zainab is ramin with ramin is playing with zainab or zainab is playing with ramin so i'm going to write here zainab is playing with ramin now number d smaller shahir is mathar than shahir is smaller than mathar is smaller than mathar number e reading m book a i i am reading a book so this is to do your work grammar work and jumble sentences you are going to write it in copy okay and words meaning you are also going to write it in copies okay this is to be our work so you are going to write that in your neat copies also thank you